Hey everybody, welcome back to Montreal Connected. Well, from the gym with the NHL players, we now fly off to one of the top training centers in the world for aerial freestyle skiers. Our Kelly Gregg files that flight plan. Welcome to Lac Beauport, just 20 minutes north of Quebec City. It's a small town that gets some very big air. This is the training ground for Canada's best freestyle skiers. Nestled away on the side of a ski hill, it's the place to be in the off-season. Travis Garris is just one of the Olympians who trains here every day from May to October. To be honest, this is one of the, well, to me it is the best facility, the water ramp facility that I've ever trained on. I've been to Switzerland, I've been to Lake Placid, I've been to Park City, and, and this is really just next level. I love it, and um, just the atmosphere here is awesome. They kind of all look like this, but the water ramp here is definitely one of the, one of the best ones in the world. Um, the pool is massive. It's very safe for the athlete because sometimes accident can happen. You can't catch an edge, we call it, and totally fly off sideways, and you wouldn't really miss the pool here. It's, it's big, it's deep, you won't hit the bottom. Um, the bubble system is a great system. It really minimizes the impact when the athlete lands. It's a mix of water and air, so it's just like minimize the impact. Not only when they try a new trick, but every day jumping, they do like about 1,500 jumps a summer, so it wears your body out, and with the bubbles, it's a bit better. Another feature of these ramps is that they're fully adjustable for height, slope, and different freestyle events. The thing that we have a bit different than the other one, we have um, nine different kickers with the hydraulic system there. So we can service like aerials, uh, moguls, and slope style. Uh, slope style athletes now come train more and more here because the double kicker goes down and it's a more of a flatter jump and more what they're looking for. Not only is this one of the best technical facilities, it's on home turf. Before, athletes had to train abroad for the chance to represent Canada. Being able to train here in uh, Lac Beauport in Quebec City, it's, it's just it really makes everything easier. I remember when I was younger, we would go to Lake Placid in, uh, in the States, and you know, it's kind of a long drive, and you know, parents had to come, and you know, a bit more expensive too, so now that we've had uh, this facility, training is a lot easier. I am literally here a lot more time than I am actually in my own home. It's definitely a home away from home, for sure. Although aerials is a winter sport, most of the work is done right here at the water ramp, so that once winter rolls around, all the athletes have to do is tweak their jumps and stick their landings. When you go to snow, you go with what you got. <laughs> you go with what you learn on water. And uh, so it's a very different, for a coach, it's two different type of training. When you do, well, in the summer, it's warm, <laughs> and you do a lot of technical work. This is where you, you fine tune the jumps or you learn new jumps or you change technique. And then when you're done with the summer, when you go in winter, all you do is try to get the athlete to build his confidence to the level of the water ramp and try to keep that all winter. Oh, and he drops into that so you don't learn nice anything jump. technically, you don't yeah, learn new the, jumps, you just go ramp. with what you've done on water. What you see on TV on snow and our competition and us jumping, I mean, that's all the result from our summer training. Aerial skiing is a winter sport, but 70-75% uh, of the training is in the summer. Uh, we qualify our jumps here, we learn our new jumps here, and then we have about a month before the competition season to try, to try them and do them on snow and then compete them. So, uh, you know, it's, it's mostly summer training, it's all our training that we get. 